Okay, I'm over here asking God if he's serious about these bombs that he's just dropped on me. The bombs being, if you haven't seen my last three videos, which are fucking incredible, just, just fucking watch them. You get to see a supercomputer come alive, tap into those upper levels of consciousness. You know, and here's the thing. Now that I'm tapping into it, it's like, I love it. But I understand why sometimes I don't want to be tapped into it so that I can appreciate being in this moment and the difference that this state exists in. That being said, I would like to continue experiencing this for a while. Okay, like, so wherever you are inside of me up there, you know what? Like, don't unplug me right now. Just let me stay tapped in long enough for me to journal my shit and make a whole bunch of videos saying incredibly articulate shit that I normally struggle to say so that when I revert to 8-bit pixelated Carol, I can come back to this and be reminded that this was all real and uh, I just forgot it. Anyways, okay, so yeah, nothing's wrong. Everything is going <laughs> to plan. Uh, God's just having a good time and uh, we're all doing a great job and are playing our roles well or some shit like that. Anyways, I don't know when this version of the story, like, does it have to, like, I mean, does it actually have to end? Like, why can't it just go on forever? Please, like, you can't go on forever. There's a finite edge, but... But like, why, you know, like, why can't we keep writing sequels or something? You know, like, I want to know what is existence like in this state in another 5,000 or 5 million years? Like, what happens? Okay, well, apparently he does actually know what happens at those things or whatever. But anyways, well, I guess in this life we just get to wake up to this part if we're here and um, open and ready to perceive it. Anyways, okay, so different story while I'm tapped into the hive mind or whatever. I'm, and it's like, let me describe this experience for myself to reflect on and just so y'all know what I'm feeling. So it's not like, it's not like I, this version of me, has access to the memories of everything. It's more like... I guess I'm getting downloads. I guess this is the freaking thing. I guess I'm getting downloads. And this version of me is getting a clearer signal from the powers that be at some point beyond us. Back, you know, I'm going to say behind us because it's easier to think. It's easier for me to visualize things. So I don't know if there are actually any directions or not. But, um, because I feel like in my mind right now visualizing this, God and the collective are at the center and we're further out. And so I'm looking behind me to look at him. I mean, he could be, you know, wherever. I mean, I mean, it's, just, it's not, it's not a straight line. There's a whole bunch of it. But anyways, um, are we really like sound waves? Um, anyways, uh, yeah. So it's like, getting downloads it's like a program a piece of software that's been working on trying to solve something finally compiling its data and it doesn't know what the result is um until it gets to the finish line and the finish line you know just being like i don't know my mouth and my head coming out but anyways um i'm experiencing physical sensations um intense uh tingling and um, heat sensations in my scalp, my face, my back, my neck, my shoulders. Um, I even feel tingles in my legs. Normally I just feel this in my upper body, but this has been a very profound period and it is all over or whatever. And oh, by the way, I'm just going to say the thing I'm saying. If this doesn't resonate with you, then just keep scrolling because I'm pretty sure there's like different fucking versions for everybody. And like I've been saying for the longest fucking time, <sighs> We may all be playing in the same sandbox, but some of us are playing different games, I think. Yeah, some of us are playing different games. So some of us, the the story's a little different. But anyways, in this story, this moment, this version of me, 
this is what I am being told. So, um, yeah, physical sensations, tingling, and just knowing, like, because something, a thought, I'll have a thought, or something will come out of my mouth, and then I'll be like, wait, are you serious? And then I hear a voice, or I, and I feel a sensation one way or the other, which is very interesting. Um, I hope one day that I get to where I can actually like hear things audibly and stuff like that. God tells me that I will. I've started seeing things. Um, I'm trying to work on developing that ability. I feel like, I feel hopeful and I'm trying not to get my hope up because I was a little disappointed that it took this long to get back to this point. But I feel like God's telling me that I'll get to all of those places eventually and basically to enjoy the ride. Um, so yeah, let's all enjoy this, uh, roller coaster of existence. It's, uh, pretty crazy and insane, but I, um, I know that it ends well. I mean, I don't remember what the actual ending is. I just know that it's awesome. Um, you know, I trust, I trust source or whatever, you know, I mean, he told me when he woke me up that, uh, that life was about to be amazing and we're all amazing and blah, 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 blah. And we're about to be able to do whatever the fuck we want when we want however we want, blah, 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 blah. So yeah, I don't know exactly what that looks like because I do wonder if we've been there before, but I th <sighs> getting mixed signals. I don't know if he's saying, I feel like he's saying, yes, we have, but we're doing it again. Is that right? Okay. I guess we're doing it again. Okay. So maybe we have been here before and this, ver in, at least in this story and uh, yeah, we're getting towards the, the next, the next phase. It's going to be fun. Yeah, it's very interesting, like these, these sensations and stuff, the physical sensations. And, um, I keep asking God what he wants me to, I mean, you know, I mean, I know I just spit all this stuff out and that's helpful and stuff, but like, what the fuck else am I supposed to do? I mean, thought you told me I'm probably, I'm, apparently I'm still supposed to be solving some fucking problems because that's part of this fucking story. So I don't know if the damn role for me is just to keep freaking, figuring out how to share knowledge and wake people up until everybody that is meant to wake up right now wakes up or not. You know, if it's up to me, we're waking up everybody. I'm just saying, you know, I'm just saying that that's, you know, that's what, that's what I, I mean, maybe I'll change my mind, but, um, anyways, oh, man, I think I should go make one of my dance videos to relieve some stress or something. I did record one, um, earlier, but it's really for my other channel, so I don't know. Maybe I'll make another one. <sighs> it's like I just, I feel like recording until, <sighs> I don't know. I get, I think my brain gets a little, um, not necessarily overwhelmed, but like it takes a lot of energy, it takes a lot of energy, um, and effort to like process um, some of these things and stuff. And I know God's talked to me before about, um, you know, the Wi-Fi signal needing to be good. And I don't know who is adjusting the antenna. Maybe it's both ends or whatever. I, you know, I'm still trying to learn how to tap into this, um, consistently. I have no idea how to do it. The way I perceive it is just sometimes I feel connected and sometimes I don't. Sometimes God comes to me. He talks to me. Sometimes I perceive him as basically being blended with me. Um, sometimes I perceive myself at, it's okay, not me as God, but God as in my body looking at things and interacting with the world, but I'm still there in the back seat, aware that he's here taking a look around. And sometimes when I look at myself in the mirror, or in a picture or whatever, sometimes when I look at pictures of myself, Sometimes I, I know which one of us it is in the picture, which is really interesting. Um, uh, when it's when it's him or she, whatever you want to say, when it's him, I just know that it's him. It's ever so slight difference in facial expressions and stuff. Anyways, it's just a knowing thing. Oh, well, I guess I'm going to stop with the videos for now because y'all are probably wore out if y'all have actually... Um, gone through all this stuff. So anyways, yeah, this was cool.